Welcome to the tutorial. Know about electrical panel and maintenance. Electrical panel. Part 20. Control system. Star delta starter is to be continued in this part. Performance of star and delta connection. Comparison of star and delta performance in detail. The phase voltage is considered as 400 volts 3 phase. For reference, referring to the figure given here, we can find the current and voltage in a star and delta connection. In star connection, the voltage available in one winding is root 3 of the line voltage. One end of each winding is joined in a point, which is known as neutral. So the phase voltage is 400 volts divided by root 3 equals 230 volts. The impedance of the coil is assumed 20 ohms, then the phase current is 230 volts divided by 20 ohms equals 11.5 amp. In star connection, the line current is equal to the phase current, which is 11.5 amps, but the phase voltage is root 3 of the line voltage which is 400 volt divided by root 3 equals 230 volt. So that, when a motor is working, according to the given parameters, the current consumption shall be 11.5 amps in a star connection. In a delta connection, the voltage available in one winding is equal to the line voltage which is 400 volts. As seen in the figure, all coils are connected in a loop, and each joint of the coil is connected in each phase. So, the phase voltage is equal to the line voltage. The coil's impedance is assumed to be 20 ohms, then the phase current is I equals V divided by R. That is, 400 volts divided by 20 ohms equals 20 amps. In the delta connection, the line current is root 3 times of phase current, which is 20 AX root 3 equals 34.6 amps. So that, when a motor is working in a delta connection, according to the given parameters, the current consumption shall be 34.6 amps. Here I given, a real vision of the star delta panel. We can see, three contactors and a timer. At the starting stage, contactors C1 and C3 closed, and at the same time timer T1 also energized. After a specified time, the timer activates, C2 closes and C3 releases. C1 is the permanent contactor. Find the real-time step-by-step working of star delta contactors. When power is on, the contactors C1 and C3 are closed, and at the same time, timer is also energized. After a specified time, the timer activates, C2 closes and C3 releases. C1 is a permanent contactor. One important thing to know is, why a star delta starter is used, for motors that have high power. You can see the sample calculation provided here. As mentioned here, when a motor is working in a star connection, 
the current is 11.5 amps and in a delta connection, the current is 34.6 amps. So, by considering the inrush current of the induction motor, which comes 5 to 8 times of the starting current. So that, in a star connection, the inrush current should be, less than the delta connection. This is the end of part 20. Control system to be continued to next part. Thank you for watching the tutorial. Subscribe to the channel to get more videos and updates.